Ifa Wings TV with well, United manager Warren Feeney after a disappointing 4 2 home reverse against Worthy. Uh, firstly, Warren, a few people asked like, why, why you weren't actually on the bench today. Um, I was suspended from last season from the Haven game, so I'll be uh, I'll be there Tuesday night. But uh, yeah, I've had the first two games this season suspended. And you've made uh, four changes for your starting eleven. New signing Tom Dickens come in, uh, Taylor yeah. Maloney, Adi Aziz, and, and Manny Perry all came in. Uh, what was your thinking behind that? Just a wee bit of fresh legs. I wasn't happy with last week, um, and I'm just thinking what way can affect the game. And uh, as I said to you, try and uh, hurt hurt Worthy. Um, and you know, I made my decisions and I stuck by them. And obviously, we unfortunately we've gone down very early, but the, the lads showed a good bit of character and a nicely worked goal for, for Tyree Pye to get it back to one all very quickly. Yeah, no, I said to them, um, it's unacceptable the way we defended today. Totally unacceptable. I'm not hiding, I'm not wanting him to beat about the bush. You know, you can't concede four goals at home and score two. I hit the crossbar twice and lose the game. Um, you know, it's a great goal by Heidi, we got back in the game. But as I said to you, we can't we can't concede goals like we conceded goals today. Yeah, and obviously we've gone two one down and then three one. I think the third goal particularly disappointing because it's a, it's a long set piece come in and, and the guy's not the biggest guy and he's got above our defenders and, and headed it in. Yeah, I have to look at it again and I don't know whether it's it's he's headed against his chest or what the boys are saying. But look, we've got to defend it better. I think all the goals today should have been defended better. Um, I'm not happy at all with the way we went about it. You know. They're a good side, but I think at times we showed them too much respect. Um, but whenever you got about them, um, you know, we got joys. I said you would hit the crossbar twice today, and uh, there just wasn't enough, you know, at times putting pressure in the final ball into the box for a striker. It wasn't great. Yeah, and you sort of changed the formation a bit, correct me if I'm wrong, but it looked like a sort of diamond to start with, and then we sort of went to a more basic 4 4 2. Is that yeah, correct? Yeah, no, listen, it was a three, um, but yeah, I went to 4 4 2, but it doesn't matter like, what formations you play. At the end of the day, you look at the goals we conceded today, they weren't based on formations. They were based on individual um, and collective errors. And that's a disappointing part for me. Yeah, Adi Aziz has got off the mark. He's then hit the bar and obviously at half-time it, it, it's 3-2 and it's game one. And again, a, a, a silly mistake probably to concede the fourth one and, and that's almost game over. Yeah, I told him. I said the next goal is going to be crucial. Um, you know, and we're, we're then, you know, got the goal before half-time, doing 3-2 and you're thinking, you know, the next 10, 15 minutes is crucial. I thought we started the second half very well. Um, it was a great ball, Rob flashed across the front. Um, but again, we got done by a sucker punch and uh, it was a terrible mistake. And I told them that, you know, defenders for me have got to defend, not think they're good players. We're at this, we're at, we're at this level for a reason. Um, and I told them in there, I'm not one to share about the bush. You know, defending's a damn breed. And you got to clear your lines, and unfortunately, never cleared his lines, and we got punished for it. I mean, I thought from both teams certainly kept going well, considering the heat and the conditions. And obviously, you made some substitutions, brought some fresh legs on. Um, and how did you think the subs fit? No, I think so. You know, look at the end of the day, it's it's we're two games in this season. Um, it's still very very early days. We're 19 new players. You know, I thought that we got to give the, the subs a chance to try and change the game. Um, we are still gelling together. But uh, look, I'm not. I'm disappointed the way we conceded the goals, but I'm not going to lose sleep over it um, because it's very, very early, early days in this season from where we are, and um, you know we've just got to stick together and bounce back on Tuesday night. Yeah, and as you say, I mean, I think we're doing a, a look to decent side to me. They're they're a settled team. They've had a lot of the same players in the last couple of years, and at the moment, obviously, we're a team of individuals to get to know each other. Is that a fair comment? Yeah, definitely. I think so. You know, I think we've got eleven or twelve players from last year still, but we knew they're a good side. Um, I think if you. You know, they want to try and play the right way, but you know, you can see this league if you, you be physical against them, you know, you can get joy. Um, but you know, I'm just looking at the goals we conceded today, they were they were unacceptable for me. As I said it, that you know, all the player you have, uh, there were errors for me. Um, running off the blind side to set play, from a throw in the first one, it's just the little things we've got to be a little bit more streetwise. And the boys did it in training, but you know, that's the difference when you get out in that pitch, that's where it counts. We didn't do it. Yeah, and I think we can just uh, pay tribute to the, the, the poor guy that uh, collapsed behind the goal. I think they're still looking after him. I don't think it's anything uh, life threatening, but obviously everyone at Wellington sends their best regards to him. No, definitely. Look, it's never nice at anything like that in football. And as I said,
Well, I think we've got a good, good home crowd. Go home disappointed tonight, but obviously, hopefully, they'll be back on Tuesday. What, what's your message to them? No, definitely. Look, it's, it's early days, as I said, it's one game. Um, you know, the good thing about it is at the minute we'll look as if we're going to score goals, uh, which is the big thing. You know, the, the times we had last year, going through it in the last 10 games, was difficult, but, uh, you know, we'll look as if we're going to score goals, but we've got to make sure we're tightening that, that defence line up, and uh, we've got to start on Tuesday and do that. OK, thanks, Ryan. Thanks for your time. Thanks for your honesty, and uh, we'll look, look forward to a better game and a better result on Tuesday. Thank you. Thank you.